sun that warms you here shall shine on me, and those his golden beams to hear you lent shall point on me and gild my banishment. Mowbray, for you remain to have your doom, which I, with some unwillingness, pronounce. Thy sly, slow hours shall not determinate the dateless limit of thy dear exile, the hopeless words of never to return, breathe I against thee upon pain of life. A heavy sentence, my own sovereign age, and all I look for from your friends is mouth. A dearer merit, not so deep a maid, as to be cast forth into the common air by deserving in your highness's hands. It boots thee not to be compassionate. Then I turn me from my country's life. Dwell in solemn shades of endless night. Return again. Lay on our sacred sword your banished hands. Swear by the duty that you owe to God, our part wherein we banish with yourselves, that you shall never so help you truth and God embrace each other's love in banishment, nor never by advised purpose meet to plot Contrive or calm lot ill against us, our state, our subjects, and our land. I swear, <coughs> and I think he all for this. Norfolk, so far as to my anatomy, confess thy treasons ere thou fly the realm. Thou hast far to go, bear not along the clogging burden of a guilty soul. No, Bolingbroke. If ever I were a traitor, my name be blotted from the book of life, and I would have it banished just from hence. But with thou art, God, thou, and I do know. And all too soon I fear the king shall rue. For while my liege, now no way can I stray. Save back to England all the world's my way. <laughs> <laughs> 